you think I might have religion as a holy assassin, but nah, I don't. Damage drunk, you have met the enemy who possess damage adjustability. Two main types of damage are physical and energy damage. Weapon attacks must uh, frequently do physical damage. Some creatures possess the ability called damage reductions, which lowers all physical damage the creature receives by a certain number, depending on the creature itself. In the description of the ability, it's always specified for DR. Okay. As soon as you step into the chamber, your vision seems to darken and your knees buckle. You struggle to keep your balance. The air in here is laden with the power coming from the stone. Suddenly your head is filled with voices, screaming, whispering, cackling, threatening voices, pleading for help, shrieking curses and taunts. You blink and the illusion passes. A demon with a mocking smile stands beside the ward stone. Congratulations! You made it all the way here. This is it, your precious ward stone. But what are you planning to do now? Hmm. I could kill you where you stand, but wouldn't it be nice if you could die in battle like heroes? No. I want you to die in despair scrabbling around like rats in the blighted ruins of your city, blind and broken, your flesh scabbed and seeping, and every moment knowing precisely what was done to you. Uh, sounds terrifying, except that's how we've been living for generations. There isn't a soul that can't resist the temptation of the abyss. Even a stone can be turned. I'm not joking. Your precious ward stone, weakened from the injury inflicted by Daskari, has almost succumbed to my charms. Soon the whole barrier around the world wound, the gift of your useless goddess, will be a weapon of the abyss. Just a little more and boom! Mingo's laugh rings through the chamber. Every city with one of these eyesores stuck in the middle of it, from Kinnebras to Nerasine, will turn into smoking craters and all the mortals into red sludge beneath our hooves. So, you have a choice. Especially you, my pet. The demon blows stout in a kiss and then holds out her leg, which ends in a cloven hoof instead of a foot. Kiss me on my dainty hoof. Pledge your loyalty to Baphomet. And when the world falls, its ruins shall be yours. Um... Shall we do some talking? Always like the talking, right? Who are you? You've already forgotten me? You mortars have awfully short memories, even shorter than your little lives. Stoughton, Sweetums, don't you want to introduce me to your friends properly? No? Well, I'd better do it myself. I am Minaro, Lelutu, and faithful servant of Baphomet and leader of his armies. The city is mine now. I'm just starting to settle in. Get things just how I like them. But once I'm finished, I promise you the results will be simply to die for. And it was such a charming little place until you sullied it with your presence. It had such lovely boulevards, quiet and shaded. You look, you took those away from me, and I shan't forgive you for that. They have done much worse things than spoil the promenades, all the people they've killed. 
Yes, 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 of course, you're right. I agree for the common folk as well. Uh, what are you doing to the stone? Well, quite... What I'm doing to it, the demon brings her clawed finger coquestishly to her lips. Probably the same thing I did to many of your comrades, sweetly and tenderly persuading it to abandon the mortals and join our side. Perhaps to fight to the death, demon. We won't let that happen. Uh, let's see. Angel Mythic Pass, reveal the light of heaven. Your victory celebrations are a little premature, demon. I performed. Echoing the holy flame erupting from your hand, the light also gets brighter and brighter until it floods the chamber. You hear the voices again, stronger now. They repeat your words like a core choir of angels. You performed a good action. Uh, Baphomet. Baphomet. Did, can anyone put the, the pronunciation of Baphomet in the chat? Because um, I'm not sure I'm saying that right. The demon giggles. Uh, but you hear a note of astonishment in her laughter. A man standing among the cultists turns to her. Hey, no eyes. Did you tell us that heaven had turned its back on us and no one would come to our aid? Don't listen to her. The fiend wants us to lose all hope. She won't succeed. The cultists glance at each other, hesitating. At last, the man who was first to speak up against me go rips Baphomet's unholy symbol from his chest and cast it to the floor. I'm done with this shit. I only followed this hoof menace because I thought the Crusaders had had it and there was no other way to protect my family but now I see that there is hope. I won't bow before these heinous idols ever again. If they kill me, at least I die a decent death. Yes, return to our side, friend. Have courage, we will be welcome you back and heaven never abandoned you, no matter what this deceiver told you. Uh, Descari Cultus, a tattoo covered cultist reaches for a remises. Turn cult, I'll cut your heart. Neophyte Cleric, we'll see you tough you really we see how tough you really are an elf with a face deformed by acid burns throws her whole unholy symbol at him you let you uh, we let you frighten us once but it won't happen again the heartbeat quickens okay well first you gotta take one of those okay um Study target. Okay. Now I should be able to Cultus flat footed, let's go. Okay. Well let's concentrate on her. Go there. The wrong Go there. Go there. Let's go. Come on. Okay. Light of Angels. Get in there. Uh, well, um, I think I just got killed. That is, I'm tired of playing around here. Irritation seems to me. You want to know what will happen when I'm done with the... Here's a little demonstration. Uh, 
Your character has failed a saving throw against the ability channel negative energy damage living used by the many malign spells. God dang it. Okay. Spell and waves. Okay. Okay, we'll do good. Performed good. Ioma Day is with us. Yes, yes, keep telling yourself that. The roar of voices blends into an unbearable wall of screaming. Your visions go dark. Okay. Yeah, I think I died. I think I died. I think I'm going to have to do that all over again. Uh, I hope it auto saved before I went through, because that didn't seem to work right. <laughs> I think I got my arse kilt. Oh wow. Was I supposed to die there? Was that the was that gonna happen no matter what? Was I just destined to be dead? Or Praise I am a day. You woke up healing your wounds was easy, but you were unconscious for so long. I was starting to worry we lost you. What happened? Gain 920 experience. My uh, classes seem to be clouding up over here. Okay. There we go. My eyeballs are sticking together. We couldn't stand up to the demoness. She, her spells were too strong. Erebeth Ira, punches her fist into her palm. It's all right. We'll handle it somehow. You blacked out, but Stoughton and I managed to get you here. To the Defender's Heart. It used to be a tavern, but now it's our headquarters. We're gathering our forces here, and we're preparing to strike back. I found a cultist dispatch in the dungeon. It seems they are holed up in, up in the Tower of Estrad. Uh, item lost. Cultist dispatch. What is the situation in the city? Bad, but not hopeless. We're constantly getting news, and new sources are, of resistance keep springing up in the, dis in the districts. Where everyone seemed to be dead, the survivors are gathering here. You should see them, their faces, their eyes, burning with determination. The city is destroyed, but our resistance is not broken. We will keep fighting. What do you plan to do next? You heard what that demon said. We're going to desecrate the Wardstone and blow up the whole barrier around the world wound. That would be an even worse disaster than the world, world wound's expansion before the Second Crusade. Not only Kinnebrus, but every city with a Wardstone will be destroyed, including the capital. We can't allow that. No matter what, we will retake it, even destroy it if we must. Iomade's gift must not become a weapon of the abyss. Uh, tell me about the Wardstone. Why is it so important? The Wardstones are, are a gift from Iomade, created from her by her herald, a mighty angel and general of the celestial armies. The Warstone keep the world wound from expanding. They stand along the border of the territory controlled by the demons, creating a barrier to keep them inside. The Kinnebrisk Obelisk was the first to be placed. It is the key to the whole barrier. We cannot leave it in the hands of those monsters from the abyss. Can I help you in any way? First of all, we need to decide what to do with the stone once we get to it. Airbreath lowers her voice almost to whisper. What I'm about to say is classified. A traveler came to the city recently, a blind elf calling himself the Storyteller. He insisted he be allowed to examine the ward stone, and he raised the alarm when he, his study was finished. Even before the demon attack, He'd found some damage or flaw in the stone. Prelate Holron 
dismissed his words as nonsense, borderline blasphemy. But between you and me, the prelate's opinion isn't worth much. I think the storyteller knew what he was talking about. We could use his advice right now. If only we knew where he was. Hmm. I remember the storyteller. Spent a lot of time talking to Stoughton. A dwarf from my unit. Yeah, we were just together. We, you, yeah, anyways. You saw him during the demon attack. The elf asked him about the history of the Crusades. Maybe the storyteller, storyteller told Stoughton something about where we could find him, if anything happened. There's another problem. After the attack, the de demons began to gather the forces at the Great Garrison. It will be even harder to take them with a head on assault. But I once heard soldiers talking about a secret entrance to the garrison. Trouble is, I have no idea where to look for it. While, you're ex while you explore the city, please keep your eyes open. In case you find something we can use. The half-orc smiles at you encouragingly. And one last thing. The Eagle's Watch has lost a lot of soldiers recently. Some were killed, but others simply haven't been seen since the attack. And the chaos that is now Kinnebrus, it's next to impossible to confirm anything for sure. Arabeth clears her throat. One of the missing fighters is Jana Aldori, a new recruit in the watch. She got along well with Sila, and she often went drinking with her. I honestly thought Sila and Jana had died together, but now Sila's return, and there's no sign of Janna. If you learn anything of her whereabouts when you're out in the city, please report back. Everything is clear. May the goddess help you. We're still fighting, which means that Kinnebra still hasn't fallen. If you come across any groups in the city that can fight, send them here to the Defender's Heart. We'll need every fighter we can muster for the final assault. I guess. Yes, one more thing. One more thing after the last 20 things? Yeah, I guess. No, no, no big deal there, Arabeth. You just keep talking. If you're in the area, check out this address. It's our house. Mine, Anivius. Well, it was our house. If the building is still standing, open the hidden compartment in the kitchen. It's filled with supplies for a rainy day. You can take whatever you find. You have more need of it. Okay. Do I even have any more comrades? Or am I now alone? No, I still have comrades. I still got a... Is there an auto-sorting thing? Yes, I've got way too much weight on me. Yeah, I get it. Um, they need a... Is there a way to sort it to where I... Yeah. I know I can go to weapons, and I can look at all the weapons I have. A friend in need is a friend in need. How did you... Find okay. I'm finding, yeah. I'm pulling up a whole bunch of new uh, quests there. Common cause in trouble times, some people side old feuds, gather their allies for the attack of the great garrison. See, now can I? I uh, wish I could sort this by. Oh, there we go. I can. Um, price in descending order. Okay, so this is very expensive. Half plate. Ooh, wait a minute. Can you wear half plate? I mean, that that gives you up there.
Boom. Nice half plate. Um, you already got a shield, so you... Got, got that cultist heavy shield going. All my usable items there. Notables. Diamond dust. Okay. Others. Tail sting. Ingredients. Shiny chitin. So I'd want to keep the stuff that's for ingredients for brewing potions, right? Because in case I ever brew potions, I don't know. Yeah, change shirt. I don't think there's anything better. Okay. Now, the truth is that I'm supposed to be more dexy. But my max dexterity is three, so this helps with that. Um, okay. I get a plus two insight against undead, so if we ever go up against some undead, I'll be I'll be good to go. Look, I'm a loot hobo. Hey, wait. Mind if I bend your ear about something? That's all that's been going on so far. I need to just... So, here's the first and most important thing. Beth gave you a crucial mission. I get that. And I know you'll get the job done. I, I've seen you in action. But here's the rub. By sending you out on an errand, we're weakening our defenses here. If they come at us while you're gone, I don't know if we'll be able to fight them off. Okay, everything seems clear so far. What else do you wish to discuss? Uh, everything seems clear so far. What else do you want to discuss? So the riff that damned beetle left with its scythe. Yeah, well, it cut the city into two and it's kind of difficult to get across. My scouts tell me there's a halfway decent place to set up a crossing in Market Square. Not that any of them have tried, to, uh, tried it to make sure, but if you've got a mind to go across, and I think you're going to have to eventually, you might want to give the square a once-over. So this is where I get like 18 different quests that I, I can choose from, right? Do you want me to stay here and guard the tavern? When do you think the demons will attack? Your guess is as good as mine. I might not be here. They could attack the whole damn city. Those vermin know they're lo they've lost the upper hand and we're going to push back hard. If things kick off here, you should know after they attack, some things could be changed beyond recognition. So if you've got any business that needs taken care of, you'd better do it soon. Uh, do you want me to stay here and guard the tavern? You what? No, your task is far too important. Didn't she just say she was worried about me doing my task if they get attacked and I won't be here? Okay. Make up your mind. Nivia, you're kind of wishy-washy on me now. You can't just hole up here all cozy-like, waiting for the demons to knock on the door. We need to take the fight to them. But if those freaks try to make a move on this place, Beth will send a runner to get you. If that happens, you leg it back here, all right? Because if you don't, you'll be coming back to an ash pile. Thank you for warning. See you later. Okay. 